Cheers. Uh, so, I like your fin. <laughs> Netflix just announced their new dating show, and somehow it combines shows like The Masked Singer and Love is Blind all into one bizarre concept. And honestly, this might give me nightmares. Has reality TV gone too far? Let's get into it. Netflix's new reality dating show, Sexy Beast, is one you honestly have to see to believe. On the dating show, singles meet for a night of non-judgmental romance while covered in elaborate prosthetics and costumes so they can't judge each other based on looks. Like I said, it takes parts from other popular reality shows like The Masked Singer and Love is Blind, and these singles are dressed as dolphins, devils, scarecrows, mythological creatures, insects, and more. I guess Netflix really does have something for everyone. Are you ready to see this? Here goes nothing. Welcome to the strangest blind date ever. Hey, how you doing? Damn, how you doing? How you doing? <laughs> Could you fall in love with someone based on personality alone? What is your ideal woman? Personality for me is everything. And while this idea is completely unlike anything people have ever seen, it's actually based on a similar show that first aired in the UK in 2014. In the US, A&E also worked on a similar show called Sexy Beasts from Beast to Babe. So now, Netflix's revival of this concept will follow several people as they go on blind dates dressed head to toe in costume. At the end of the show, they'll take off the masks and makeup and see if their connection is strong enough for a real relationship. The first installation of the series has six episodes and drops July 21st on Netflix. And if you just can't get enough of Fish and Scarecrow's dating, a second season of six more episodes is set to be released later this year. Naturally, we had to head to Twitter after hearing about this show because we knew the reactions would be priceless. And we were not wrong. One person shared the trailer and wrote, This is like Love is Blind but with my sleep paralysis demons. Another fan chimed in saying, This looks horrific. I'm gonna watch it five times. This person brought up a valid point saying, Literally defeats the purpose of it if they're all conventionally attractive. And this person simply said, What the F Netflix? All of this actually got Love is Blind trending on Twitter again, with people saying things like, uh, why couldn't we just get Love is Blind season 2? Again, I can't decide if I'm going to enjoy the show or if I'm just going to have nightmares, but either way, I can assure you one thing, we will definitely be watching. We'll keep you posted if we hear anything else about Sexy Beast before its July release date. But for now, for more Netflix news, click right over here for another clever news video. Also, make sure you let us know down in the comment section below your thoughts on this dating show concept and if you're going to be watching Sexy Beasts. I'm Ashley Mova. You guys can find me on Instagram at Ashley Mova. Bye, guys.